Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to another video. So as you guys can see in the title, today we are doing a Sephora haul. Yes, we are doing a Sephora haul. I spent, hold on, I got the receipts here. So I spent one, I spent $300 on Sephora. And today we're gonna do a full face of the new makeup I bought and we're gonna review them. If you guys wanna see if these makeup products are a hit or a miss, then keep on watching. So the first product I got is this Sephora Brightening Eye Cream. So it's a brightening under eye cream. It says it hydrates and attacks dark circles. It's from um, Sephora's new like clean line they have. They have like, oh, they have like skincare. That's what they have. And so one of the ladies at the office there um, convinced me to buy it. So I was like, okay, because I have dark eyes. So I'm gonna be, this I use it twice a day. So lately I've been using these products. So right now I don't really see, I think I see a difference a little bit. This is how the products look. I've been using it a lot. I've been using it already. So yeah, it is not scented at all. Um, It don't really do much. <laughs> I mean, it's just like a dark under eye cream for like under eyes if you have like dark under eyes, that's all. I'm gonna use that for about two or three weeks and see how I like it and see if it's a hit or miss. Right now, I really can't review it right now because, you know, <laughs> it feels very nice on the skin. It feels very hydrating. It's not scented. I like that. So the next product we are reviewing is the Faded by Topicals, the Brightening and Clearing Serum. So some of these products I've already been using. Yeah, I've already been using it, but right now I really don't really see like a difference. Y'all, the smell, it don't smell good. This do not smell good at all. Like, I like how it's like, it feels lightweight. It's been really popular on TikTok a lot. And like, there's like, it works for dark under, for like dark spots and everything. Me, like, like I have a lot of dark spots. It's not a lot how it used to be, but, but like, I still like have dark spots around my face. Yeah, it's very lightweight. I like how it's like really lightweight. But the only thing, one of the con about this, it smells, it don't smell good. You see, like it just it just hydrates my skin. And I and I really like that. But yeah, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep it using this and I'm gonna update you guys, see if it's worth it or not. So yeah. Okay, so the next part we are reviewing is the Bobby Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Face. Y'all, this is this is not a new product at all. This is not a new product at all. Like I repurchased this because this is good like this is the best like i swear by this so like this is like a face base and it just moisturizes and it primes your skin it just leaves your skin so like glowy hydrated i swear by this your makeup will look you put this on top of your makeup your makeup will just look so good afterwards i promise you and it smells so good too like like the topicals and this on top of my face my face is like ready. Like this is really good. So I'm gonna put this on my drawer. I mean, I need to get the bigger size, but the bigger size is like $60, I think. But yeah, this is so worth it. Like if you ever thought about getting it, get it. This is really good. But it's it's an old product, but it's an oldie but goodie. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna do my base. I'm going in with the Morphe Hint Hint Skin Tint. This is not a new product. I already bought this, but like today we're just doing light makeup. Put this on top. I don't see a lot of people talking about this, but this is just feels like skin. So I'm just going to like blend this out all of my skin. This is my thing right now. Okay, so now I'm already done applying my skin tint. Next, we are going in with this one product I'm really excited about. We are going in with the Makeup by Mario Concealer. This one, y'all, I already tried this. But this one, oh, I love this one. Like, this is like one of my favorite. Hold on, let me show you guys like the applicator. You guys, can you guys see the applicator? Like, this is one of them ones, literally. This product, oh my God, I love this. I, I did a review on it, I'm gonna like link it somewhere. I did a review on the Makeup by Mario Concealer. It says it does not crease or anything, and y'all, it really doesn't. Like, I just put a little bit under my eyes. I said a little bit, look at me, but putting a lot. This is really good. I am not returning this one. This is like really like one of my favorite now. 
But I think I'm gonna blend it out with a, with a brush, so. Like, I don't know, it just, it just feels so good on the skin. I love it. Okay, guys, do you guys see it? Like, I just like it. I just, how it just looks so, like, skin-like. Like, y'all, like, if someone says it creases, it does not crease. Like, I know this one girl, um, Gloria, on TikTok said it creases. It does not crease. Like, I love it. I, I really like this. If I see a makeup product is good, it's good. I've been seeing, like, mixed reviews on it. Me, I don't, I don't lie. Like, if something is not good, especially a makeup product, if it's not good, I don't like it. Period. But this one, I love it. Okay, so now we are done blending it out. Next, we are going in with this one. It is old to y'all, but new to me. I just got this product because they came out with new colors. Came out with new bronzing colors. I tried to get the bronzing colors before, but like none of them like was really come to come to. You ever had a dreams that that you um you had you you huh? none of them <laughs> none of them was complimenting my skin tone like it was too red or too gray for me so I got the new rare it's not new the new rare beauty bronzer this is how it looks and everything y'all see oh my god I haven't used this one yet, so this is my first time reviewing it, and I am excited about it. But I'm gonna put it like around for how I always apply my bronzer contour. Um, thank you, my forehead, cheeks, then jawline. And also the bridge of my nose as well. Ooh, I did this too hard. It's okay, I'ma fix it. I always fix it. I heard that this blends so good. So we're gonna see if that's true or not. So let's get to blending. Let's go. Hmm. Okay, it's blending really good. Okay, hold on. Okay, it's blending out very well. I like it. Oh wow, it does blend out very good. It blends out so like soft. But the only thing is like, I don't know about the color. Am I like bronzed up? Okay, I'm going in with the brush and blending out my nose contour. Y'all look. Y'all, it blends out very nice. I like that. Yeah, what do y'all think? Am I like, do I look bronzed up? I think I do. But I feel like, is this, I don't know, if, did I get the darkest shade? Let me, let me check one second. I got the, one, two, three, the fifth one. I feel like I could have got the darkest. Oh, because like, I like a bronzer that shows up. Is it showing up? It's showing up, but the actual product, I love it. But the actual color, I don't know if I might go back and change it. I know I'm not gonna go back and change it. I don't even know why I said that. <laughs> I don't know, I might. No, I'm not. Um, but that Rare Beauty product, it is a, a Rare Beauty um, bronzer stick is very good. I like it. The color, I was just a little bit confused about the color, but I like it. So right now for brows, I'm just going to just brush out my brows. I didn't buy any brow products. Um, yeah, to be honest, I really, honestly, I suck at doing my eyebrows because like people all my life compliment me by my eyebrows. So like I don't really do my brows like that. So I just like literally just brush them. But the next part that I'm going to use to set my face, I am going in with the Ami Cole Translucent Powder. Y'all, this is a black owned brand and the owner is from Senegal. Y'all, I love this powder. Let me tell you something, if you are a black girl, get this product. This product literally melts into your skin. 
Like you know with translucent powders, sometimes like they give you like that white coast under your eyes. This product, it does not. It just like, it just melts into your skin so good. It literally melts into your skin. I think that's what it's called, a skin melting. Yeah, skin melt powder. Then I'm going to go set my eyes. So I'm going to come back and set my eyes because we're going to be doing eyeshadow. Okay, so I just primed my eyes and now I'm about to wipe off all the powder with a big fluffy brush. So next I'm just going to go in with blush. I'm going to go in with the Juvia's Place blush and just apply just a little bit to the upper of my cheekbones. I always apply too much. I always apply too much. But y'all, guess what? We're gonna fix it. Okay, so now after I'm done applying blush, the next and final product we are going to use is the da -da -da, the Makeup by Mario Matte Shadows. This is the Makeup by Mario eyeshadow. This is the most expensive product, okay? I love this. It's really cute. I like the packaging and everything and the colors. I look at the colors though. Like when I drop eyeshadow, this is what I want. Okay, so I'm already prepped my eyes off camera. I'm not really good with eyeshadow, so bear with me. <laughs> I'm going to go in with my transition shade. I'm going to go in with this color right here. That and just put it all over my eyelid. That all over me and me. I'm going to go in with this brown shade right here and just put it like all over the eyelid. The colors are very pigmented. I want to try this black. So this one, I'm gonna do this light color shade right here and put it like on top of my eyelids, just like right here. Yeah, see it. And like with another blending brush and just blend everything out now make sure everything is well blended okay I don't know if I should do black so next I'm gonna go in with the black eyeshadow and I'm just going to put do an eyeshadow do like look and do like a little like an eye wing y'all this is black Okay, y'all, so here is the final eyeshadow look. Um, I'm not the best at eyeshadow. I know, like, a little bit, a little bit. I'm not, like, a pro. I just know, like, how to do, like, a little one to the transition. That's it. But mostly, like, I'm not really a pro at eyeshadow. But I like how it came out, though. But this palette, I like it. The, pal um, the colors are very, very pigmented. So now I am completely done with my makeup. I'm going to go set my face with the Morphe setting spray. Oh shoot, I think I'm almost out. I'm, oh, and also, and also last but not least, I also forgot I got the Ami Kole Lip Oil. I love the color and everything. This is really good. This is very one of their popular products. None of this is sponsored, by the way. I just like makeup. <laughs> so this is their lip oil treatment. Um, I like the way it feels, no. Um, I like how it feels on my lips, moisturizing and everything. But it's so, the only thing I don't like about it is like it's so small. Like, 
like it's very small I can get I don't get like a lot and it's y'all it costs twenty dollars as well I might not repurchase this but it's cute okay but y'all here is the final look y'all I love my look I love it it looks so pretty I like my eyeshadow oh my god I actually like my eyeshadow usually I'm not really good at eyeshadow overall I love everything in my makeup that I bought most of the stuff I will repurchase and also eye cream the topicals um discoloration thing um I'm gonna do like I'm gonna wear them consistently and like then do a review and see like if it's good or not so I'm gonna do that in an updated video. But yeah, y'all, I hope you guys loved the video. And also, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me guys what you, what your favorite products that you like and one of the products that you will buy or you already have. You know, I have a posting schedule. I post every Monday and Friday. So make sure you tune in every Monday and Friday because you will get new videos from me every Monday and Friday. Period. <laughs> okay y'all thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it make sure you, again you guys like comment up and subscribe so i can keep pushing out videos every monday and friday i am pushing out videos every monday and friday i am consistent i am a consistent queen okay and see you guys next time